Welcome, Welcome to being able to move things with your mind. Hmm. Okay. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back to the Jolly Maze Channel, Media and Mesh Gaming and Entertainment. I'm your homie, Jolly Dangerous. And we're back playing Saints Row 4. On the last episode, we discovered that we can do telekinesis. And I also have to apologize that my audio was out. Pick up and throw objects at people. Oh, I can pick oh, I can throw people. Okay. And then R2 to throw. Alright, nice. Alright. Pick you up. Just throw you. Oh, I just throw. Oh. Oh, yeah. This is going to come in handy. Whoa. Giant floating ball. Yeah. It has more clusters in it. Pick it up with your mind and smash it open. That one of those, another one of those things is about to come. Oh, okay, never mind. Okay, now use that power to throw things at the warden and take down his shields. I'm gonna hit you with a ding. Oh, nope, never mind. Oh. Uh. Go ahead and switch guns right quick. Come here, punk. Where you go? Oh, all right. I can throw some too. I can throw some too. Okay, I can't grab him. Uh, nope. Uh, what's up? What's up? Get some. Nice job. I'm sure you'll have plenty of chances to use it. I guess you gotta double tap for that one too. Power up Sid complete. Anyway, as I was saying before, I had problems with my mic, so I didn't have any audio on my last video. I hated that so much, but I forgot what I said. Um, but hopefully, you know, you guys will still enjoy the video anyway. I didn't die or anything like that on it, so. At least it was of some use. Okay, switch to okay, cool. And hopefully you guys will, will continue to keep watching it. Some good, get some damage. Hmm. Okay. Oh, nice. They can bring me more stuff. Can be called into the simulation using the hub for me. The AI will help. The Saints in combat. <coughs> Excuse me. New gateway unlocked in downtown. Return to the ship. Access your weapons, cash, clothes, vehicles, and gain customization here. Okay, finally, that's where you access your stuff at. Man. The bonus rifle fires social butterflies. Very deadly social butterflies. Equip it at your gateway weapons, cash. Bounce rifle. <laughs> social butterflies. How did that thing keep guys? That thing keep getting out. Ooh, dual wheel pistols. Yeah, let's take those out for right now. Whoa! I know I can pick up stuff that big. Uh. I wanna kinda follow it. Yep, sure can. That's that's cool. And it's still going. And the spirit. Alright. So we're gonna go ahead and move on to the first mission. Let's do that now. Keep pressing the wrong thing, sorry. Uh, go to the machine, go to the training room, all right. You coming with me, buddy. What you screaming for? It's a fun ride, man. Just be lucky. This is better than a, <laughs> this is better than a taxi. Look at this. That is crazy. I can just carry this dude with me. Is he still with me? Nope. I, I guess they uh, either disappear or they automatically get thrown after so far. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> I was having so much fun carrying that guy. <clears throat> Hmm. 
Welcome to Mind Over Murder. The rules are simple. Each scoring area contains a variety of floating rings. The color of the ring denotes the type of object you need to throw it through in order to score a point. Vehicles go through blue, people through green, and the head of our very own Professor Genki through the pink ones. Score a point on every hoop within the time limit, and you win. Good, Good luck. luck. It's murder time, fun time. I don't get the references to that cat. Okay. Two. One. Go. Welcome to Professor right. Genki's Mind Over Murder. Give me a car. Brought to you in part by everybody's favorite alien overlord, Sinyan. You. That's right, folks. The maven of mascot mayhem has teamed up with the conqueror uh, of countless galaxies uh, to create an all-new Genki experience. As folks at home know, by uh, exploiting weaknesses in Zinyak's you. meticulously crafted Go simulation, our contestant has gained uh, the person. power of telekinesis. You. But they will have there. to master the power of the mind to complete the challenges ahead of them today. I can Get now see why the professor was so oh, eager yeah, to join forces with Zinyak. This should make for an interesting addition to the Genki family what of What just games. happened to me? I just, right I just you are, glitched. Bobby. So let's meet our contestant, the winner Car. of Genki Ball 7. Come here. Go and our favorite contestant, Person. the president Anybody. of the oh, United no, no, no. States. Oh, come here. Come here. No, 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 no. are still floating Bring around in space, right, Zach? Go <laughs> too soon, Bobby. Too soon. Let's and get to the action. Cat. So, Bobby, cat. how do you think um, the addition of superpowers um, is going you. to affect the game? You a submachine gun is a Go fine no. weapon, but nothing, nothing compares to the Man, unlocked potential of the just, human animal. I know you didn't. Super uh. speed, super jump, and moving things around with the power of your mind. I'm expecting high yeah, action and lots of flailing bodies. You do that. <laughs> Makes you wish Ooh. you had superpowers, Ooh, doesn't yeah. it, Bobby? Oh my I gosh, I'm keep not missing. Be stuck in a bath missing. full of foul-smelling nutrient milk. We're Got living it. my worst fears for all of eternity. <laughs> you and me both, Bobby. You and Next. me both. Can you imagine Genki oh, and Zinyak oh, flying across the galaxy together, conquering worlds and abducting the biggest badasses each planet has to offer, and pitting cool. them against each other Got it. in a superpowered fight to the death? The cat. Bobby, are you feeling all right? Got or it. they could team up against an army of the mascots, flaming mascots, armed you, rocket Desiree, give me your car. and no, RPGs. Give me your car. <laughs> That's oh, no, a fine dream, oh, Bobby, gosh. but... As you know, the uh, you world's know biggest badass I'm, I'm, was yeah, locked away years ago. Really True, do. but we're not allowed like to talk at all. about that. <laughs> no, we're not. I have to do body. too much bullshit. Man, here, here. No, give me your ride. Give me your ride. You ain't even gotta get out. You can have it back. Just jump out for him. Now, this is happening to you. And that's it for our first match. Excellent yes. job by our contestant. I didn't want to do any more of those, man. Huh, pimp walking. Uh, oh, up, uh, what? Uh, uh, huh, huh. Hit that step right there. One, two, uh, 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 huh. Hit that step right there. One, two, uh, 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 uh. Man, you ain't tired yet, man? I'll be I mean, breathing hard. Man, I'm stepping. What? 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 Okay. All right, we got the money, we got the bonuses. All right, we are level 16 now. That means we unlocked more stuff. We're gonna continue. Oh, what? Harder instances of prof. Okay, I don't need none of that. Quest complete. Ghost in the machine. So. I say we go ahead and do. Uh, we can do one more mission. Oh, what is this? Obey. Meet Sid on the ship. If you want the reward, you'll do this. The simulation recognizes hacking extra time. I don't need none of that stuff. Telekinesis element life steal. Dang it. All right, I'll do that later. Uh, I don't do side missions on here. I don't record side missions. I just go straight through. The primary quest, I do side missions on my own time, and I suggest you guys do the same because I don't want to spoil the whole game for you. So, um, I will do that later. 
and that way I can get the telekinesis element life steal. Probably I can get more health by killing other people um, with telekinesis. But anyway, uh, let's do the zero core real quick. You ready to pick up Matt? Um, are you really sure about this? I mean, I know he can help, but it's Matt Miller. I don't think now's the time to be picky. How do we save him? Well, I give Sid the proper cipher to connect to Matt's personal simulation, and he opens the gateway. Run right on, let's do it. Yeah! Okay, I hate having to collect these things, too. They are annoying. Whew. Go. Go, 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 go. Gotta go faster, Whoa! faster, fast, fast, faster. Go, 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 go. Sonic is. Gotta go. Gotta go faster. Gotta go faster, 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 faster. Sonic X. Anybody used to watch that when it when well when it was on? I don't know if it's still on anymore. I remember the old school Sonic. I mean, like the very very old school '90s. Was it '90s? I think it was either '90s or late late '80s. Sonic the Hedgehog. That's like with Dr. Robotic Whoa, game. They used to play that um. Da -na 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 -na, that that music. That um. Orchestra, piano, Beethoven music. And you know, he used to be eating chili dogs and stuff like that. That's the original old school Sonic. That's the Sonic I remember, that the one I like. Okay, where do I have to go? I have to go here. I was shocked when the boss picked you to be the vice president, but you ended up working out. That's only vaguely insulting. Look, you sound just like Julius Little. Putting a guy who betrayed you in the number two slot seems like a great way to get killed. Really? I'm nothing like Julius. Kenzie, we're ready. I'm sending Sid the jailbreak. Any last advice? When you're That's tight. Mapped virtual oubliette, there's a decent little reference to a character he played. With the intrusion countermeasures, so pay attention to the console commands. Any last advice I'll understand? Don't get killed. Gotcha. Matt Miller, self-proclaimed hacker god, ran all the cyber terrorism for the syndicate back in Steelport. Now he's Asha's right-hand man in MI6. I just hope we can trust him like she does. Oops. Kenzie, where's my gun? Well, you don't have superpowers either. Are you kidding? What the fuck is on the screen? It's a command prompt. Just give me a second. No clip. Nice. Fuck me. Not again. Damn it. The camera's screwed up. <sighs> You'll just have to deal with it. Easy for you to say. You're not dealing with the top-down bullshit. Okay, well, how do I... Okay, that's how I shoot. Oh, okay. Wow, this is like straight up old school scroller type thing. Ah, man, I hate this. Okay, that's how you spend a turn. Anytime you want to fix this, Kinsey. I'm trying, but I'm not used to the code they're using. Give me a second. Oh my gosh, okay. There we go. Can I just roll it? Can I just run on one? Yeah! Is 3D? Don't enter a space! Oops, sorry. Finger slipped. See what I'm doing? I can't zoom in. There we go. 
What now? What now? What's up? Ooh. Thank you. There should be three data towers controlling the security to Matt's prison. About time I get to cause some property damage. Well, I wouldn't want you to go outside your comfort zone. Okay, destroy the gatekeeper. I must say, I am amused at this attempt to save a man who tried to kill you once. <laughs> <laughs> I've worked with worse. All the same, what is it you hope to accomplish? Mr. Miller is beyond your help. What I hope to accomplish is to put a bullet in your fucking head. <sighs> Very well. Your futile attempts do entertain me, after all. That went pretty much like I thought it would. Okay. That's kind of simple enough. Speaking of 90s cartoons, what was your favorite 90s cartoon back then? And I don't count Power Rangers as a cartoon, really. Because I think everybody who was young loved Power Rangers. And don't say anime stuff, because anime is like a whole different thing. When they had Dragon Ball Z coming out back then, I remember that. Everybody was loving that stuff. People still references rapper even. Rappers even talk about Goku and Super Saiyans and stuff. I'm talking about like old school 90s that used to come on TV like Ninja Turtles and Smurfs and stuff like that. I think, like I said before, my Got favorite situation here, Kinsey. Destroying the tower should destroy the tanks with it. Miss Kensington is rather astute for a human. Yeah, well, big towers controlling security on a linear path. Not very creative for your superior intelligence. Ugh. Touche. Did it watch that? Anyway, uh, I think back then my favorite, yeah, I think my favorite was like, um, I probably have to say, since I didn't have cable for a while, I think Yu Gi Oh! It's two, one more to go. Yu Gi Oh! was my top. For not spawning any more tanks and to kill. Sonic. Ah, are Sonic you so mad about that? Like before you go, you came out sorry. with straight straight Sonic. Surprisingly, near-death experiences that, tend to stick with you. It was Yu-Gi-Oh! all the way. It was good. Nothing? What's that? Oh, no. This reminds me of, um, Robot yeah, Wars. Yeah, Anybody seen that? that? It used to come on Channel 8. People would build their own robots and, and fight on, uh, in this, in this arena. And they would have house robots that always stayed on in the house. Not in the house, but in the arena. And they would, you would have to get, like, past these obstacles and stuff like that. And these robots, if you get flipped over, you, you lose. Or if you get into a pit, last or tower, time to tear stop this bitch down. Yeah, oh, I awesome. don't think it should be that easy for you. He's made the tower invulnerable. Hang on, I'll find a workaround. Well, hurry up. You know, I think if I had this on hard, I would have to probably be using these things to. Bumpers to uh, get get away or at least uh, block the shot. Need some help, Kinsey. Wait, let me try Whoa. something. What the fuck you thinking? What happened? No! Right on. You on bike? Where's the bike? Where's the bike? Oh yeah. So this is a this has to be like a Tron or something or something. Yet again, I am impressed by Miss Kensington. Though this attempt is as futile as the life of most humans. Oh look, an alien with a superiority complex. Surprising. Though this sentiment comes from more than just the Zin, my dear. Tomorrow and tomorrow and tomorrow creeps in this petty pace from day to day to the last syllable of recorded time. And all our yesterdays Whoa. have lighted fools the way Man, to dusty follow. death. Out, out, brief candle. Life's but a walking shadow. A poor player that struts and frets his hour upon the stage. 
and then is heard no more. It is a tale told by an idiot, full of sound and fury, signifying nothing. That sounds scary. It's a quote from Macbeth. Man, fuck Shakespeare. Jane Austen or go home. Oh, really? Well, there's not everybody in here theater major. What are you talking about? Anyway, yeah, I used to uh, like those cartoons from back in the day, like Yu-Gi-Oh and stuff like that, and Sonic. Um, all that stuff kind of changed later on. I mean, there was some really good stuff back then. Man, if I had this bike in real life, I would have drive it because I killed bust my ass. Uh, one of my, what, what was your favorite cartoon from back in the day? Just go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Um, it doesn't matter what it is. You can just like just tell me what you used to like, like to watch and stuff like that. Uh, what was good one? Coming up on Matt's prison. So what about getting into? Chances are it's not a standard behind bars sort of prison. You'll just have to wing it. Yeah, who needs a plan when you can just walk into a virtual hellhole? Oh, and since I can't see what's going on in there, Dad will be able to help you either. Awesome. Oh yeah, so you guys, hey, tell me if you like these videos. You like these videos, and also, do you like the gameplay? What's happening? Like, do you, do you like Saints Row 4? You know, how is it? To you. Oh, this is straight up the Matrix Before when it was in the room. I place a choice. Walk through the blue door and continue to face yet more failures at saving those closest to you. Your race will live on borrowed time and will, through your violent arrogance, wind up extinct. Walk through the red door, however, and I will release the humans whom I have collected. I will give them amnesty and even a ship from my fleet to do with as they see fit. However, in choosing this door, you would willingly submit yourself to execution. This is Whoa. the moment where you can prove to be the savior Whoa. of humanity, or its absolute destroyer. This can't be good. This is your life as it led you to this point. All your past violence, crimes, and losses on display to remind you of one simple fact. Regardless of what I have done to your world, you were its greatest threat. The evidence is irrefutable. How many have died because you decided that driving on the sidewalk is faster than the road? Because you used a rocket in place of a bullet. Because you wouldn't submit to my rule. In the end, you only hurt those you are trying to protect. In the end, there is only one truth. The human race would be much safer without you in it. That may be true. Just maybe. Hmm. Well, I am a guy who likes to play by the rules and I like to save people, but I really don't trust him. I don't trust him at all, really. Uh, just to kill me? I'm not sure. I'm gonna, uh, it, it, it. I'm gonna choose that red door. Alright, I'm gonna stop it here. I'll be right back. I gotta, I gotta save it. We'll come back and we'll make a choice on the next episode. Man, this is kind of like American Idol or some shit. Peace.